most custom ROM and which is Raspberry 8.6 and previous build we had some problems uh, the status bar and which was just doing a bit lag and everything is fixed in that build and it's gonna be another best custom room for this month and for some times so let's get started and here is the about section rise UI 3.0 and here is the tiramisu build and red 13 of course and rise OS version 8.6 november security update and here we have the rise droid build version and kernel use which is really really cool lineage OS plus always stable and this is the setting user interface and i video will be long so don't worry about that keep watching till the end you will get know everything so here we have the network and internet section and the user interface just like with MIUI or other things you guys can say just similar to that and here we have a different user interface and this can be changed in settings and on at the top you guys will get from first left corner you guys will get your device owner info and then we have the network and internet connected device and personalization and from personalization you guys will get the huge customization hub and this is the best customization room still now uh, then we have the CR droid as well so let's get, begin with system and we have languages and input and buttons and system profiles like lineage OS then we have the gesture as usual you guys can do customization system navigation here we have the peel length customization and we have back gesture haptic and hide IME button space if you don't need button space uh, below the keyboard then of course you guys can use this feature and immersive navigation and if you don't need the gesture peel if you hide want to hide the navigation peel button which is here then of course you guys can use that immersive navigation that's also great things and then we have other things like google and password and account safety and emergency i don't want to waste your time guys just let's move into the security option what we have we have the face unlock of course perfectly working no issues with that and fingerprint as well perfectly working and very faster and accurate i'm using this one as well then we have more security settings and you guys will get the app lock feature so everything is included in that custom room you will not be disappointed by using any customization every single possible customization is present in that custom room so this is going to be another perfect thing and there is not a lag single bit lag it's just super smooth experience i got let me show you that super smooth super smooth not butter smooth it's super or already super smooth though this customization uh, on this room always comes with huge customization and heavy customization still it's really 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 super smooth now let's talk about other things here we have the sound and vibration as usual all possible customizations are available and you guys already know about that and have adaptive sound which really improves sound quality which is really really cool and then we have accessibility battery and battery backup i'll talk about this later part in this video and we have the applications here and you guys can see all the applications by clicking there and if you want to show system applications of course you guys can do as well and this is vanilla build i will drop the gfs link in description use that one for better performance and this is personalization that means the customization hub if you want to know about the uh, the uh, developers and their supports and github and channels and of course you guys can look into that otherwise device center we have the block sensors and some new features actually included in that one and which is the scarlet you guys can see here scarlet system manager and which really boost your uh, system performance and other things and sleep mode which can be configured if you want to use that feature of course you guys can do sleep mode configure automated sleep mode settings if you need then of course ringer mode as well then we have the lock screen as usual customization ambient display you guys can do the customization additional settings also there and web screen for notification if you need then of course you guys can do 
repel effect and temperature you need whatever you need and battery info everything is here then we have the miscellaneous pocket mode smart pixel which is really really cool feature i personally like this smart pixel things and weather settings are really cool here if you want to do customization of course you guys can do and here is the important thing uh, netflix spoof that means um, when you are using netflix netflix won't be able to specify your device that if you are using a non full hd device and you can easily stream uh, easily access your high quality videos uh, full hd videos you guys can get that experience by using that custom rom because we have netflix spoofing system here because netflix won't be able to uh, specify your device model as a redmi 7 so you guys can get a, a better experience while uh, consuming or watching videos whatever you say that's cool and other things like higher fps in gaming of course this is really all cool and perfectly working and unlimited google photo storage also working without any problem so these are the things from miscellaneous and we have the notification as usual all the possible customizations are available you can see here use pop-up notification style also reboot required everything is fine here no issues with that and quick settings as it was uh, battery percent design battery style and other things battery slider brightness slider position visibility and hide qs security uh, figure on lock screen whatever qs panel style that means uh, which one i'm using right now this is called the qs panel style i'm using right now if you want to change it if you want to accent color or two tone accent whatever and then of course you just can select it will be like this then now also if you want to change the, the last one you guys can select that one as well so it will take a loop uh, just like this if you want to use those things and there is not a single bit lag in uh, the access center or whatever you can see in the control center there is no lag and every possible things is available on your control center so this is cool feature and of course here we have the uh, screen recorder also screen recorder have enable HEVC which is really really great if you want to uh, get better a better uh, recorder whatever video quality everything is available in that custom room what you need everything is available and then we have the status bar as well 4g icon background cheap battery style and battery percentage and clock and date styles and data disable indicator which is turned off right now and here is the logo huge collections of logo are available here which one you like you guys can select and network traffic indicator which is perfectly working show wi-fi standard icon and status bar icons all list icons everything is available and just have a look at sound and vibration as well then we have the user interface which called font style can be changed use collection icon packs and monitor settings and chroma factor use linear lightness whatever and navigation bar style can be changed as well and power menu style now let's talk about that if you want to change your power menu style just like this this one is power menu style if you want to change it legacy a7 of course you can do that then it will look like this and if you change it uh, classic a8 and it will be like this and if you need light a12 then of course you guys will get it like this so this is a cool feature i guess and we have search bar style can be changed as well search bar style which is pixel compact oxygen wise oxygen wise compact and uh, search bar style and which one is uh, that search bar so you guys can easily change it and this is the user interface and setting style can be changed as well miui inspired i'm using right now and ions card ui if you select that like this and it will uh, do a soft reboot then it will be look like this the setting user interface so this is the thing you guys can easily change and the network settings let me show you the things which we cannot change 
uh, we have only LTE, LTE recommended and 3G. You guys can't select 2G. So this is a disappointment for me. Actually, I always use Wi-Fi and that's why I don't need 3G, 4G, anything. Uh, I need 2G so that I can save my battery. That's why. And now let's talk about the dialer. We have by default call a recorder here. Sounds and vibration. Here you can see auto call recording is turned on. I already using this one. And audio format is this one. And perfectly working without any issue. So you guys can uh, give it a try. And the call recorder is perfectly working. Here I already uh, talked over phone. And here is the call recorder and it's perfectly working. Let me show you. I think this is cool there is no issues with that and um, here is the smoothness which is very smooth and there is nothing extra now let me show you the home settings and here we guys can uh, change the default icon pack if you want to uh, download icon packs from Google Play Store of course you guys can do that then we have the home screen as usual regular customization wallpaper zooming scrolling and other things if you want the dark status version then turn that on otherwise leave it then we have the themed icons if you need all themed icons of course you guys can enable this one and all app themed icons also available here then we have the recent background opacity can be changed clear all button clear app button is available and then we have the miscellaneous as well and hidden and protected application you guys can hide applications without any issue then we have the widgets if you want to use that clock widgets of course you guys can do that and we have wallpaper and style and we have other things if you click on change wallpaper and here you guys can see the live wallpapers and which is uh, Pokemon live wallpaper I already uploaded the video if you miss then of course check out description and check out the latest video of course you guys will get that and team icons and upgrade options available now let me show you this one which is really cool and you guys will get here the extra uh, memory which is used and which is free you guys can see here and this smoothness is just awesome if you want to use a split screen just click like this uh, which is supported and is split top free from and app info can be selected like this and now let's talk about some basic things and yes net and the safety net is passed by default so there is no issues you guys can easily use any banking applications and now let me show you the Geekbench score which is impressive as well and if you keep using the device for some days this ROM uh, then you will get better performance and better results and here is the results and it will show um, uh, okay, let me show you that this was like this here single core is 263 and multi core is 1189 which is really really great and then let me show you other things like and here is the CPU throttling result only which is CPU throttle to 94% you guys can see here 94% which is mind blowing and for 100 threads not normal threads it's for 100 threads so which is really really impressive and you guys will get better gaming performance and let me show you another thing uh, at night 10.41 at night and the charge was okay let me show you and here is the call recording option you guys will get when you make a phone call at night 10:41, the charge was 71 percent and in the morning i checked you guys can see 71 and uh, in the morning 11 18 almost uh, more than 12 hours you guys can say well, like this 70 percent is still so i think you guys get a better clear idea about the battery backup now let's talk about the problem and which is only one problem with the november security update and that is google camera is broken still google camera is not usable maybe you can find some google cameras for your device and give you can give it a try but it will not work i guess because this is the issue with november security update but it will be fixed in 
the next upgrade so if you can sacrifice that one then of course it's gonna be another perfect room for you and this is also a gaming room as well you guys can do better gaming so no issues with that so thank you for watching